Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, click the subscribe button and turn on your post notifications so you know when I post a new video. So today's video is going to be a super chill vlog, um, day in the life video. Arden went dirt biking with some of his cousins today. Me and the kids are just chilling at home. Um, the kids are napping, so I thought it would be the perfect time to show you the fall decor and the clothes haul. Okay, so before I start, I do not like shopping. I hate shopping. <laughs> so... Usually I only online shop, but this time I'm like, what if I actually go to the store and actually find something nice for the kids? And I don't mind shopping if it's just me or if it's just me and Artem, but like shopping for like five hours with kids is pretty hard. And if you're a mom, you know what I mean. Um, so Artem was watching the kids and I'm like, okay, I'm going to go to as much stores as I can and see what I can find. I went to like a couple of different targets. I went to H&M. Um, I didn't want to go somewhere far. I just wanted to go somewhere in the area. So I did not find anything. Like literally none of the stores had any fall pieces or like winter clothes. So I'm like, okay, let me go to Old Navy. And I found everything I needed at Old Navy. I only got three pieces from H&M, but everything else is from Old Navy. So I was shocked. I'm like, I should have went to Old Navy earlier. Okay, so let's get started. I found this romper for Isla. This is the one that is from Old Navy. Super, super cute. I love it. I feel like it's kind of a material of like jeans, um, but it's not too rough. So I feel like over a tank top or regular t-shirt, it's gonna go perfectly fine. Then I found this for Austin. It's so adorable. I love the colors on it. Um, and it's pretty thick, so it's not like a regular flannel. I got these joggers for Austin. They're very soft and stretchy. I like how they come together at the bottom. This is a knitted dress that I found for Isla. It's so cute. I like the ruffles right here on each sleeve. It's very, very soft and she literally has no dresses that fit her. So when I found this, I was like, wow, this is so cute. I had to get it. Next is this fluffy jacket for Isla. It's very soft, warm, it has these little um, like teddy ears on top. I think this is my favorite dress out of the whole haul. It's so cute. This color, I feel like this is my favorite type of green. I love this pattern right here. The florals, so adorable. Next is this dress, like a vintage style dress. Very cute. Also has ruffles on both sides. Ties right here. And then I got Isla two pairs of leggings because um, she's running out. And they're really stretchy, have ruffles on the bottom. I found Isla these shoes. They're so cute. Can be worn anywhere, to church, going out. Um, I feel like they're gonna be very comfortable. She's a size seven. And then I also found her these boots. So cute. Um, I feel like they're very comfortable because they're like pretty bendy and they're not like rough. So they kind of are taller too. The next item is from H&M. This is a flannel that I found for Austin. It's so cute, very soft. I love the color. Literally all these colors are so like fall vibes. Another dress shirt for Austin from H&M. Super um, soft material also. These pants are from H&M. I like how they um, kind of come together in the bottom. And they're very, uh, the material I would say is pretty much similar to jeans, but softer. And then I got Isla three of the same shirts. They're just regular shirts. They're from Old Navy. Another pair of joggers for Austin, the same as the first ones. These jeans for Austin. I feel like I love pants for kids that come with strings. I feel like it's very comfortable for the kids and for the parent to tie. Okay, I found this set at Old Navy and it's so cute. Comes with these pants and this shirt and it has a hoodie and it's so cute. The pattern is flowers. Last but not least is this jacket, this beige jacket. Perfect for those rainy days. Love the color and it's actually really, really soft on the inside. And that is the end of the clothing haul. Okay, so really quickly before I show you guys the fall decor, I wanted to mention that I'm super simple when it comes to decor and I don't really go all out. Um, every single thing that I'll be showing you is how it's already placed in our home and a lot of the stuff I had for a while, but um, I'll tell you what I got recently. So I had this throw for like a year from Target. Super cute and soft. Love the color, so I added it to the bed. 
And then I got these pumpkins recently. I like that they're lightweight and woven. And I feel like no matter where you put them in your home, it's going to make the space look cute. So I put them onto the dresser. This candle I got recently with this little vase. I like that it's shaped like a pumpkin and it smells so, so good. It smells like vanilla cupcakes. Artem does not like candles, but I'm a fan of candles. So this vase is really cute because all the colors, I just feel like are fall colors and I just had to get it. And then this is what I've had for a while. The grass and the vase is both from Amazon. So I feel like I wanted to add it just because I feel like it's very full vibes. So next we have this space in our home and it's kind of the awkward space we call it because it's like, I don't know. I feel like you either have to put like a decorative piece here, which we did, or like a picture frame or something to fill the space. So I wanted to get a tall vase. So I found this vase at Target and I love that it came with these stems already in there. And originally I would probably do like something white, but I loved the color combo. So I just kept those. And this I all had before. So I got this on Amazon a while ago, the beads. Um, I don't even remember where I got these. These are from Target. Um, I kind of just randomly decided to put that together. Last but not least is this setup right here. I got this throw from Target. I always wanted to get a fluffy throw for our downstairs couch and it's so soft. So I'm so happy that I found it. And then I got these pillows, pumpkin pillows. I was originally thinking of getting two different pillows, but then I'm like, eh, whatever, I'll just keep them the same. And this is like my favorite corner of the house. <laughs> to come outside to capture this beauty look at that wow looks like a painting honestly so pretty and um, the and woo and back and We're just hanging out on the couch waiting for Arden to come home. He should be home any minute. You were eating cereal? Yeah. Yeah, I could see. Um, um, it's dark yeah. outside, yes. Cookie. You want to eat a cookie? Which cookie? Mama. <laughs> You're so silly. Isla's such a silly girl. Mm -hmm. Hi. Hi. Mm -hmm. You want Papa to come home? Yes. Yes, okay. It's going to come. 
coming now. Austin, how old are you now? Three. Yeah! Good job! Yeah. How old is Isla? I am two. Yes! You're two! <laughs> Playing soccer. <laughs> Kick. Oh, oh my goodness. Careful, Isla. Kick it to Austin. Kick it to <laughs> She kicks it. Kick it to Austin. You, oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. She is a crazy child. <laughs> there he is. Ready to scare Papa? Yeah. Okay. Ready. Set. The long lost dirt biker returns <laughs> with Taco Rate your dirt biking trip out of 10. 11. It's never bad. Anybody got hurt? Nope. That's good. Nope. <laughs> Anyways, I wanted to mention that I want Artem to film one of his dirt biking trips the next time he goes. He was supposed to today, but he didn't have time to buy a mount for the GoPro. But next time, he'll for sure uh, film it for you. It's the next day. We are on the way to church. Say hi. Peach iced tea. Okay. And then, so unfortunately, we're out of peach. Is there another flavor of tea that you like? We uh, have the green, we have black, we have the passion. Do you guys have mint? Did you say mixed? Mint. Artem's oh, mint. favorite tea yeah. is mint tea. We have a jade citrus mint and a hot tea. Um, just just get the green tea. Yeah. I'll just get the green tea. Okay. And what size is that? I'm sorry. Uh, let's do the uh, mix. Tall. Make sure to tell them it's iced, yeah. right? It's iced, right? What else for you? Um, a grilled cheese. Grilled cheese? Grilled cheese, okay. Yeah. And then just a water. And a water bottle. A water bottle? Anything else? I don't know. Okay, is that going to be everything for you? Am I going to get a coffee? Fine, I'll get a coffee. I'll want? get a tall um, pumpkin cold brew. Can I get a tall pumpkin cold brew? With light ice. With light ice? And that'll be it. And is that tea yeah. iced? Yes. Perfect. Oh, you hear the ambulance? That's it. Okay. All right, we'll see you down here for 18 yeah. or 4, okay? All right, thank you. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Gentle, dude. Post-church lunch. Are you excited to eat? What do you want to eat? Mac and cheese. Do you want French fries? French. Yeah. What do you want, babe? Tomato basil soup. Mmm, that's our, that's our favorite here. Tomato basil soup, Applebee's is so good. And then maybe some wings on the side. Mm. Mm. Bon yummy, yummy. Good. yummy, yummy. So good. You like? Okay, Dwight, I'll show you. Eat yours. Is it hot? It's hot. Okay, here, I'll help you. No. It's not hot. See? Isla, yummy? 
Yummy. <laughs> Austin loved his food. Isla liked the fries more. Now that we ate, we're gonna be heading home and just enjoying the rest of our Sunday. Probably have the kids take a nap and then, I don't know, maybe we'll end up doing something. But, uh, Artem is in the back to go to work later. So he needs to um, unload, right? Yeah, unload. Yeah, so he's gonna be doing that. Maybe he'll take Austin with him. We'll see. Just like that, Artem is leaving again. So, what are you doing? I'm gonna give myself a haircut. He's trying to give himself a haircut before he leaves. A short one. So that way he doesn't need one when he comes back. Um, not sure how short you're trying to go. Well, I'm gonna be going for like two weeks, so it's gonna go in fast. That's true, yeah. This trip is gonna be a little longer, so. <sighs> Usually he doesn't go too, too short, but. All right. Oh, goodness. You trying to do the sides only? Yeah, just the sides. I'm gonna leave this. The kids are playing jump rope in the background. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go shorter than this. Like. All around? Yeah. Yeah, sure. Well, maybe cut the mullet. Yeah. <laughs> Arnim loves his mullet if you didn't know. Oh gosh. Yeah. Yes, there's a big difference. Look how short it is. Turn around the other way. <laughs> oh, you look so good. It looks really good. Oh, <laughs> they sense that dad's leaving. No. Yeah. Do you want Papa to leave or stay? Uh -uh. You don't want Papa to leave? Uh -uh. You want Papa to stay home? Yeah. Oh, oh, you do? Me? I know, me too. Uh -huh. <laughs> I hug Papi. Sina, Sina. No. <laughs> I let you. Kiss Papa. Kiss. Kiss, kiss, kiss. Oh. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> what? Also, what are you trying to do? So I'm gonna close the video out here. Thank you so, so much for watching. I hope you liked this video. It was definitely longer than usual um, and just super random and casual. So I hope you liked it. 
But anyways, before I close the video out, I wanted to mention that if you didn't see my Instagram story that I posted um, like a week ago, pretty much I posted on my Instagram story that my latest video hit over a thousand views just after one day after I posted it. And right now it's currently sitting at 2000 views. And honestly, I was so, so shocked because as someone who is new to YouTube, I do not expect anything like that. So I just wanted to say thank you so, so much for those of you that subscribed, that like, share, and comment on my videos. To every single one of you that supports my channel, it means so, so much to me. You don't even know. So thank you. Um, give this video a big like, comment, and share, and I'll see you next time.